That is a situation there at uh, the Mombasa Road just after the Joma Kenyatta International Airport. We'll be coming back to those live pictures. But let's link up with uh, Duncan Haemba, who is uh, joining us live from Uhuru Highway within the city centre. Um, Haemba, the uh, supporters are meant to be making the procession towards the Uhuru Park grounds where they will be or they are scheduled to have another rally. What is the situation at the Uhuru Highway? <laughs> Michelle, at Urupak where we were about uh, 40 minutes ago, there's uh, no way the NASA team will have to access uh, the grounds. This is despite having given that notification that from JKIA their final stop will be the Hurpa grounds. The entry, all entry points have been sealed uh, by the police that have actually barricaded and put there the lorries. And even as you drive down Mombasa Road, Uhuru Highway, uh, this is uh, actually the Nyayo uh, Stadium roundabout, Nakumat Mega Nyayo Stadium roundabout. And clearly you can see they've actually put another barricade there in form of that uh, uh, lorry and uh, therefore it will be a bit difficult for the NASA team to uh, come but uh, beyond that lorry down there we can see again there's no traffic that is flowing towards the city center so it is a case of uh, the police having actually uh, decided to make sure that NASA team does not gain access to the CBD and uh, by extension to Uhuru Park grounds. So that clearly tells you what awaits them here, Michelle. And this is the current situation. If uh, we can, on the right, of course, there's no traffic that is moving. And um, you can see more, uh, actually, now they are firing uh, the, the Bunyala Road, actually, uh, to ensure that nobody comes to the city center. So that is the situation that is the scenario here michelle if you are able to see uh, right now we have uh, senior police officers that are actually coordinating this particular uh, process just to ensure that uh, by no means the nasa convoy gains access to the city center and as i said of course they'd been notified earlier actually nasa through their lawyer uh, sifuna edwin they actually notified the police that they will be coming. But there were talks that the county commander had actually asked their junior, his junior's net to receive that particular uh, actually notification. So nobody would ordinarily accept that they've received that notification. And therefore, that could be the reason as to why they will block them on, uh, on grounds that the police never actually okayed that. Yes, so that is the situation here at the Nyayo Stadium roundabout, Michelle. All right, and Ahimba, just before I let you go, uh, of course, major roads, uh, Mombasa Road, Outer Ring Road, Jogo Road, have seen business come to a standstill. But have you heard any word uh, from leaders allied to the NASA coalition? Open up. Michelle, we've not heard any word from uh, the NASA team and uh, we are waiting just to hear what will uh, be happening. But what we do know for a fact is that uh, many of them actually they went to JKIA to receive uh, him. And as uh, if I can move this way, the, a, a second lorry actually uh, coming to the roundabout and there's more tear gas. Uh, maybe we, we can just try to to drive. Emma, if we can just drive that way, maybe we'll try and see. Uh, we, let us drive down. We'll try and uh, see what exactly is happening at this roundabout. So we'll actually try to do our uh, uh, we'll try to guess and exactly what will be happening once we go around the roundabout. And uh, you can actually be able to see uh, this particular side of uh, the road. Of course uh, the Barricade, is, the blockage is actually clear, so we'll try and navigate the roundabout just to see what exactly is happening. But uh, this is the uh, position, the true position. Emma, if you can go around the roundabout kindly, 
just to get the, the 360 turn of uh, this particular road. So this is it, and uh, you can see actually the, 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 the deployment that has been done, and uh, that is why accessing that side of the city centre will be a tall order for the NASA team. And as I said, uh, this is how the Uhuru Highway uh, Lusaka Road has been done. Emma, if we can go around the roundabout slowly, so this is how the whole uh, entry to the city center has been uh, 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 sealed. And you can see tear gas canisters being fired uh, towards the Nairobi West Hospital. So gaining this particular access will be a difficult one. And um, on our right, on our right, you can uh, be able to see now that is uh, Mombasa Road proper. This is where Mombasa Road begins. Uh, Uhuru Highway ends here. We can be able to see uh, more tear gas canisters uh, down there at the South Sea, South Bee flyover. Of course, we've seen the vehicle that uh, was able to uh, pass here. So we will try and uh, see exactly where this one will lead to. But remember that the NASA leadership was trying to uh, actually focus on uh, uh, gaining access to the roundabout. And as I said earlier, that is where we, we actually, we, and I'm not so sure the shots that you are getting right now, but now more deployment is coming down. Uh, from uh, the officers that were at the Bunyala Road, now they are coming down to this particular one. And this one should be able to tell you that um, uh, moving forward, actually it seems like now they are concentrating more uh, boots here, more boots actually being brought here at this particular one, just to ensure that uh, NASA will not have anywhere, they will not have their way and access 